If, if I can braid this that's on my, like, I'm holding you down, bro. I'm paying your bills. <laughs> like, like, stop trying to play with, you know what I'm saying? And, and pray for my brother, bro. Like, I'm please because there's some weird stuff going on in a jaw-dropping twist blueface's brother andre harvey has blown the lid off chrissy and rock's recent claims branding her a liar the drama erupted after chrissy and accused blueface of betrayal in a fiery video asserting that she's been paying off his debts but andre in a bold and unfiltered statement has dismissed her accusations as outright fabrications he needs you to pay for his lawyer fees when whack handles his attorney fees right whack got his lawyer he a lot of cap and, and my brother not here to speak for itself according to andre blueface settled his debts long ago and isn't reliant on Christian for financial support. In fact, he revealed that Christian is currently living in Blueface's house because she can't afford her own place. Andre didn't hold back, accusing her of being homeless, exaggerating her income, and even robbing Blueface by selling his jewelry. He painted a picture of Christian as the one struggling financially, not Blueface. So if you're not doing it, then you low-key technically rob bro because you don't have any money you haven't really generated any revenue what have you been doing this explosive revelation has sent shockwaves through the fan community igniting a new wave of controversy and speculation with andre's scathing comments the feud between christian and blueface has reached a boiling point promising even more drama to unfold stay tuned as we delve deeper into this sensational story now for those unfamiliar with blueface's brother andre harvey he's no stranger to controversy himself Dre has often found himself in the eye of the storm, known for his volatile behavior and explosive revelations that frequently stir the pot. His latest feud with Christian Rock is just another chapter in a long history of public disputes and scandals. So this message is for my brother, whom I love a lot. It's my little You know what I'm saying? One particularly infamous incident involved Dre clashing with their mother, Carlissa Saffold, who tearfully discussed his ongoing mental health struggles on Instagram Live. Carlissa, who has never had an easy relationship with Christian Rock either, revealed that despite her efforts, Dre's mental health has been a persistent challenge. By the time I was your age, I had three kids that was never homeless, never hungry, never without, never had bad grades in school, and, and I got that done. Her heartfelt plea, however, was met with mixed reactions. While some viewers expressed sympathy, others took the opportunity to drag her for her past criticisms of Christian Rock, accusing her of hypocrisy. So talking about Christian's baby every other day, then coming on here crying, who is going to take you seriously, one user wrote. The tension between Carlissa and Christian Rock's fan base has only fueled the drama further, with accusations flying from all sides. Dre himself hasn't held back from airing grievances against his mother. In a scathing Instagram post, he accused her of failing to support him throughout his life, claiming she allowed abusive behavior from her partners and neglected him during his formative years. You know, like not even on no other but just out of a hurt place. Like my feelings is hurt. Like how the fuck you going? What? I'm your child. This tumultuous family backdrop sets the stage for Dre's latest salvo against Christian Rock. Her recent claims that she's been financially supporting Blueface while he's in jail were met with a fiery rebuttal from Dre. According to him, Christian is the one struggling financially, not Blueface. Dre alleges that Christian is currently living in Blueface's house because she can't afford her own place, going so far as to call her homeless. He even claimed that she once spent the night at the airport due to her dire financial situation. I'm not trying to speak, I'm just trying to like let you know when Cap is going on. Krishan was just sleeping in an airport on the floor like a month or two before my brother went to jail. Dre didn't stop there. He accused Christian of stealing Blueface's jewelry and exaggerating her income. His accusations paint a picture of a woman desperate to maintain her image while living off Blueface's generosity. These revelations have only added fuel to the fire, with fans and critics alike taking sides in this messy feud. House, bro, but I think that's the tax lady house, and she be letting her use it for cap, for flex, right? That's because why are you at my brother's house? You know what I'm saying? Like, Christian Rock, for her part, has vehemently denied allegations. In a series of Instagram Live videos, she defended herself, asserting that she has been covering Blueface's expenses, including legal fees and rent for his restaurant. I just got with a couple teammates and, you know, Sky or whatever. And whatever, I get drunk or whatever. Woo -woo. She also pointed out that Blueface is benefiting more from their arrangement than she is, emphasizing her role as his supporter. Are you with me? And I was just like, bro, f you, bro. Like, what are you arguing with me for? I went outside. Whoa, whoa, da, 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 da. bro, I'm not cheating on you like that. She also addressed Blueface's accusations directly, insisting that she returned home to care for her son after a night out, contrary to Blueface's claims that she was neglectful and irresponsible. 
What do you say? Obviously, y'all see how I be on, like, locked down. Don't go nowhere. You feel me? I don't go nowhere. It's annoying sometimes. So, like, the back and forth between Chrissy and Dre has captivated their fan base, with many eagerly awaiting the next chapter in this unfolding drama. As Blueface's release date from jail approaches, the stakes are higher than ever. Will the rapper's return bring resolution, or will it escalate the conflict further? One thing is certain this family saga is far from over, and the public can't get enough of the twists and turns. Adding another layer to this complex narrative, recent events have spotlighted Christian Rock's mounting personal and legal troubles. It's becoming increasingly clear that Dre's accusations may hold some weight. Christian has been embroiled in numerous lawsuits that paint a troubling picture of her current situation. Just last November, Christian was served lawsuit documents during a high school football practice. The lawsuit, filed by James Wright Chanel, a backup singer for Tamar Braxton, accuses Christian of assaulting him at a concert. According to Wright Chanel, the altercation left him with broken teeth and facial injuries, requiring medical attention. The incident reportedly stemmed from Christian's anger at not being allowed to perform at Braxton's concert. Witnesses, including Braxton's team member LaTroy Davis, claimed that Christian arrived at the venue intoxicated and caused a scene. When I like came back to it, everybody's mouth was still like, it was unbelievable. Because it was for no reason. The severity of these allegations against Christian has not gone unnoticed. Wright Chanel's attorney, Kevin Anderson, emphasized the unprovoked nature of the attack, criticizing the fact that Christian was able to leave the venue without immediate consequences. This lawsuit adds to the growing list of legal battles she faces, each one threatening her public image and financial stability. So when I contacted the therapist, she said, it's trauma. Mm. And so she was like, trauma will wake you up out of your sleep. In another legal headache, Christian is facing a $1 million lawsuit filed by Irby Lashala, a hairstylist who claims. Christian assaulted her at the premiere party for the reality show Baddies West Lashala's lawsuit cites assault, battery, and emotional distress, alleging that she was attacked without provocation. <laughs> This incident at the Zeus Network event highlights a pattern of volatile behavior that seems to follow Christian wherever she goes. Adding to the chaos, Christian's legal woes extend beyond these physical altercations. She has been open about her efforts to clear up outstanding bench warrants from past convictions in Oklahoma. These include charges for failure to display a tax stamp on a controlled dangerous substance and possession with intent to distribute. Christian has taken to social media to assure her followers that she's working diligently to resolve these issues for the sake of her son. Chrissy and Malone Jr. I'm gonna work on my little situations and stuff. That's all about it, but um... Despite these efforts, Christian's temperament continues to land her in hot water. She recently lashed out on social media at another individual who had filed a lawsuit against her, showing little remorse or restraint. Her combative online presence has only fueled the public perception that she's struggling to manage her personal and professional life. Amid these legal battles, Christian's relationship with Blueface remains a focal point of controversy. Dre's claims that she is financially dependent on Blueface and living in his house out of necessity are particularly damning in light of her legal and financial predicaments. The allegations that she stole Blueface's jewelry and exaggerated her income paint a picture of desperation as she scrambles to maintain her public persona while facing significant legal challenges. Hello, my name is Yamu Salam from Burnsville, Maryland, and seeing stuff like this pisses me off because it's like a case of a celebrity going crazy with their ego. Christian, however, continues to push back against these narratives. She insists that she has been a steadfast supporter of Blueface, covering his expenses while he's in jail. Her passionate defenses on Instagram Live highlight her determination to shift the focus away from her personal struggles and back onto her role as Blueface's loyal partner. I'm pretty sure she don't have no money, like straight up, you know what I'm saying? Like with a little bit of money is probably because she done probably sold my brother's jewelry. As Blueface's release date nears, the anticipation builds. Will his return provide the stability that Christian desperately needs? Or will it ignite further conflict within this tumultuous family dynamic? The public remains on edge, eagerly waiting to see how this saga unfolds. A considerable number of fans have expressed skepticism towards Andre Harvey's claims. One fan commented, she did not say anything about paying for lawyers. She said she is paying rent at the house and the restaurant. Dre does not know anything. This perspective suggests a belief that Christian's financial contributions are being downplayed or misrepresented by Dre. Another fan highlighted the repetitive nature of the drama, stating, it is just crazy she has not learned anything. Is not this last year's problem? Nobody should be upset. Okay, you are paying blues bills. And what do you want us to do? This sentiment reflects a growing frustration among fans who feel that the issues between Christian and Blueface are cyclical and unresolved. What do you think about Andre's explosive claims? Do you believe Christian is truly supporting Blueface or is she the one in need of help? Share your thoughts in the comments below. We love hearing your opinions on these dramatic twists and turns. Until next time, stay tuned for more juicy celebrity gossip.